Okay, so let's do this problem on the law of conservation of mass. So it says, um, aqueous solutions of mercury 2 nitrate and potassium iodide will react to form a precipitate of mercury 2 iodide and aqueous potassium nitrate according to the reaction that's written on the board. So if you add 3.25 grams of mercury 2 nitrate, so mercury 2 nitrate, 3.25 grams, the mercury 2 nitrate to 3.32 grams of potassium iodide, what is the total mass of the reactants? Okay, so potassium iodide is here, so 3.32 grams. So remember, which, what are the reactants in this chemical equation, guys? On the, left side. the ones on the left side, okay, so all we have to do is add these two together, right? Those are the reactants. And both of those numbers are given to us, okay, so let's just put them in our calculator. 3.25 plus 3.32 is 6.57 grams. So that's the mass total of the reactants. Is everybody okay with that? <coughs> it says then, what would be the total mass of the products after the reaction? What would that be? It's the same. The same, right? What would, what's that number? 6.57 grams, right? 6.57 grams. So, in other words, the total here total here, mass, of the products is going to be 6.57 grams as well. Well, how do you know that? Because of the law of conservation of mass, right? Okay, so the law of conservation of mass says that matter can't be created or destroyed, so the, the um, additive sum of the reactant should equal the additive sum of the product's mass. Is everybody okay with that? And then the last uh, problem says, if there was 4.55 grams of mercury 2 iodide formed, what would uh, the mass of potassium iodide be? So it says 4.55 grams of this stuff, oh, potassium nitrate, I'm sorry. What would the um, mass of potassium nitrate be? So how would we go about figuring that out? Subtraction, yeah. So we would take the mass total, so in other words, let's just write this out. So the mass total here is going to be the mass of mercury 2 iodide plus the mass of potassium nitrate. And they, we got the mass total, and sorry, we're looking for the mass of potassium nitrate, so let's just rearrange this equation. So that's going to equal uh, mass total minus the mass of mercury 2 iodide. And then you don't have to do all of this, of course, but it's nice to like look at the actual formulas that you're using, right? So we got 6.57 grams here, and we're going to subtract, what did we say, 4.55 grams? the right number of significant figures? Now why is that the right number? <laughs> so there's two after the decimal place is one. Okay? Right? Both of these have two after the decimal place, so this has to have two after the decimal place. Okay? So that's the mass of potassium nitrate. Is everybody okay with that? And again, like I said, I'll put some on the review sheet for you guys. Questions?